Welcome back to Science Recent. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of blood types. You've probably heard of A, B, AB, and O, but do you know what these letters actually mean? Let's unravel the science behind ABO and RH blood groups. But before we do, remember to subscribe to our channel for more science-backed content. The ABO system. The ABO blood group system is the most well-known way of classifying blood types. It's all about antigens, proteins on the surface of your red blood cells. If you have type A blood, your cells have A antigens. Type B? You guessed it, B antigens. AB has both, and O has none. The immune response. So why does this matter? It's all about your immune system. If you receive blood with antigens your body doesn't recognize, it triggers an immune response. This can lead to serious complications, which is why matching blood types for transfusions is crucial. The RH factor. Now, let's talk about the RH factor. You might have heard of people being RH positive or RH negative. This refers to another antigen, the RHD antigen. If you have it, you're RH positive. If you don't, you're RH negative. The RH complication. The RH factor is especially important during pregnancy. If an RH negative mother carries an RH positive baby, her body may see the baby's RH factor as foreign and produce antibodies against it. This is usually not a problem in a first pregnancy, but in subsequent pregnancies, these antibodies can cross the placenta and attack the baby's red blood cells. So there you have it, a quick dive into the world of blood types. It's a complex system, but understanding it can save lives. Whether you're A, B, A, B, or O, RH positive or RH negative, your blood type is a key part of who you are. Thanks for joining us today, and remember to subscribe for more fascinating insights into the world around us. Until next time.